The BAE Systems Hawk and Hal Kiran are two renowned jet trainers. The Hawk, a British design, is a more modern and advanced aircraft. It boasts worldwide success and continues to be in service today. The Kiran, hailing from India, represents a robust and capable design. It has served admirably with the Indian Air Force for decades. Both aircraft provide a stepping stone for aspiring fighter pilots. They bridge the gap between basic training aircraft and high-performance fighters. This essay will delve into the capabilities of both aircraft. Finally, it will determine which aircraft reigns supreme as the ultimate jet trainer. The Hawk is a sleek, single-engine jet with a low-wing monoplane design. It features a tandem cockpit, optimizing visibility for both crew members. The Kiran, also a single-engine jet, adopts a similar low-wing configuration. However, it is slightly smaller and lighter than the Hawk. The Hawk's design emphasizes aerodynamic efficiency, allowing for greater speed and maneuverability. The Kiran, while not as fast, possesses excellent handling characteristics. Both aircraft are built to withstand the rigors of training flights. The Hawk's design has proven adaptable, suitable for both training and light combat roles. The Kiran, while primarily a trainer, can also carry a limited weapons payload. This enhances its versatility for secondary combat missions. Both aircraft demonstrate robust airframes capable of enduring high G-forces. The Hawk is powered by a single Rolls-Royce turbofan engine providing ample thrust. It achieves a top speed exceeding 600 knots. The Kiran, equipped with a less powerful engine, has a top speed of around 400 knots. However, it remains highly maneuverable, ideal for training in air-to-air -air combat tactics. The Hawk has a clear advantage in range, suitable for long-duration training missions. The Kiran, with its shorter range, is better suited for localized training sorties. Both aircraft can operate at high altitudes, allowing pilots to experience high-altitude flight challenges. The Hawk's superior speed and range make it a more capable platform for simulating frontline fighters. The Kiran compensates with its agility and ease of handling. It provides a solid foundation in basic fighter maneuvers. Both aircraft prepare pilots for the step up to more advanced training aircraft. The Hawk's advanced design is a testament to its capabilities. The Kiran's agility ensures it remains a valuable training asset. Though primarily trainers, both the Hawk and Kiran possess limited combat capabilities. The Hawk can be equipped with a variety of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground weapons. This allows it to be used for light attack and counter-insurgency operations. The Kiran can also carry a limited weapons load, including bombs and rockets. This provides it with a degree of self-defense capability. The ability to carry weapons is crucial for trainee pilots to gain experience in weapons delivery. Additionally, it allows both aircraft to be used in secondary combat roles. The Hawk's more extensive weapons capability makes it a more potent combat platform. The Kiran's ability to carry weapons, while limited, should not be underestimated. Both aircraft demonstrate that even trainers can contribute to combat operations. They enhance their value to air forces operating on tight budgets. Both the Hawk and Kiran underscore their versatility beyond training roles. The Hawk has been exported to numerous countries worldwide. It has proven to be a highly successful export for BAE systems. The aircraft has served with distinction in various air forces. The Kiran, while not as widely exported, has served admirably with the Indian Air Force. Both aircraft have earned a reputation for reliability and ease of maintenance. The Hawk's global success is a testament to its capabilities and adaptability. The Kiran's enduring service with the Indian Air Force speaks volumes about its ruggedness. The Hawk's legacy extends beyond training, adapted for various roles. The Kiran, while primarily a trainer, has also been used for reconnaissance missions. Both aircraft have demonstrated their adaptability and versatility. They continue to serve their respective air forces effectively. The BAE Systems Hawk and Hal Kiran are both capable jet trainers. 
The Hawk, with its advanced design, superior performance, and greater versatility, emerges as the clear winner. It is better suited to meet the demands of modern air combat training. The Kiran, while not as advanced, remains a valuable training asset. It continues to play a vital role in preparing Indian fighter pilots. The Hawk embodies a modern, high-performance approach. The Kiran represents a more traditional approach, prioritizing simplicity and affordability. Both aircraft have made significant contributions to military aviation. They have helped shape the skills of countless fighter pilots worldwide. In conclusion, the Hawk and Kiran represent two different approaches to jet trainer design. 